Making a fine Cheong Sam is a long and meticulously followed procedure. Measuring is just the first step, and each technique, such as embedding, inlaying, rolling, purling, buckling, and embroidering, takes years of practice to master. The procedure starts with drawing on paper. First, shapes for the pieces of fabric to be used are outlined, before being cut out for use as a template. The sketching may look easy, but it requires decades of experience. Turning abstract measurements into solid lines on paper is a process that, if not done with care, can go disastrously wrong. The pieces of paper and lines seem random and uncoordinated to a layman, but to a master like Leung, they clearly determine the final shape of the product. The fabric is cut into two pieces, front and back. These are the two main parts of a Cheong Sam. When cutting a margin around the templates with which to join the fabric, Composition is crucial. Different patterns on the fabric are to be placed on different spots and everything must be carefully considered. This is The sole of the Cheong Sam is determined by a pair of scissors, which, as the blades cut in, decide whether the dress is properly tailored to fully bring out its wearer's character. After three weeks of busy work, Wu Fan's Cheong Sam is finally done. She comes to Leung's studio for the third time. Okay, come on, see her soon. Oh, I'm going to go to the studio. 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 梁师傅合作
The Chinese character Zhang for craftsman is a pictogram, an axe within the square frame of a toolbox. The noun, in fact, was only applied to carpenters in ancient China. Carpenters use their life experience and skill to bring life to their pieces of work. In the same way, it takes years of experience for a tailor to be skilled enough to bring out the full elegance of a woman underneath his chongsam.